lengthening of nodes. We know that nodes can be extended for a longer duration by using ties. We can extend nodes for a longer duration by using ties. You can only tie nodes that are on the same pitch. So this means only nodes on the same pitch can be tied. Only nodes on the same pitch can be tied. Rest cannot be tied. Remember this. We cannot tie rest. A tie indicates the second line or the second note must not be played. This means holding the first note for the duration of the tied note and any number of notes may be tied. Let's take a look at that again. A tie indicates that the second note indicates the second note must not be played. Okay, the second note must not be played, meaning that you hold the first note for the duration for the duration of the tied notes, and any number of notes can be tied. A tie symbol is like a curving line. This is the tie symbol, like a curving line. Stretching from one node, uh, from stretching from the opposite side of one node stem to the other, or opposite side of the node stem, or from the node head to the other node head. This is the example of two tight notes. This is a semi brief, it's worth four beats, tied to another semi brief worth four beats. Therefore, you count one. Two, three, four, plus the second uh, note, one, two, three, four, giving you the value of eight bits. Giving you the value of eight bits. Remember, you only hold this for the duration of the tied note. Let's move on. Dotted notes and rest. A dot is another way of extending or lengthening notes. A note can also be lengthened by edit by adding a dot next to it. We can also lengthen a note by adding a dot next to it. A dot increases a note by half of its value. Uh, this is different from using a tie. A dot rather increases a note by half of its value. Remember this: it increases a note by half of its value. Half of its value. We call this kind of notes dotted notes. So notes with dots, just like here, it's called a dotted semi brief or dotted whole note. Dotted notes. We can also use dots for rest. Remember, we cannot extend rest by using ties, but we can extend rest now by using dots. But preferably, you can write the rest out in full to avoid confusion and making reading music easy and clearer. Dots are placed right next to the notes and if a note is on the line, the dot will be placed in the space above the note. So the dots are placed right next to the note and if a note is on the line, remember, the dot will be placed in the space just above the note. Let's take a look at our table. The first note that we have is a dotted whole note. There's our dot symbol next to the note. Dotted a uh, whole rest and the value of six bits. Since a dot increases a note by half of its value. Then we have a dotted minimum or dotted half note, dotted half rest and the value dotted quarter note which is a crochet a dotted crochet rest the value of one and a half dotted eighth note the dotted eighth note rest and three quarters a dotted sixteenth note dotted sixteenth uh, rest and its value